So I think the, the thing that I want to talk to you is the fact that as the DTI, we do have a scheme that we established. It's called a Black, black Industrialist Development Scheme. And, okay, uh, technology. I see they were talking about MP500 and the like. Maybe we still use the old, <laughs> the old, am I, am I doing the right thing? Oh, there we go. Yeah, so I said I'm going to talk about um, 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 the Black Industrialist Support Program that we have as a DTI. Um, unfortunately or fortunately, it's only for those who are into manufacturing um, and, and not service as such. So I, I know that most of you are into the service, uh, so you might not qualify, but what we are saying as a DTI that we need to develop similar um, a, a program um, across all sectors. So in tourism, uh, arts and culture, events, etc. So, but for the DTI, we do have this support um, a, a program and it aims to assist black-owned entities, majority black-owned entities, uh, in three areas. The first one is financial support through a grant of up to, up to 50 million. And, and also the second one is through um, uh, financial market, or, or I mean the market access. And then the last one is through uh, skills development. And in order to qualify, you need to be a, a black person, obviously, uh, or an entity that is majority owned by by black people. And then you must be operating in the manufacturing sector. Now these are some of the sectors, as you can see. We've got the blue ocean, or blue or ocean economy, uh, oil and gas, clean technology and energy, mineral beneficiation, uh, agro-processing, clothing and textile, uh, pulp paper and furniture. So you can see that uh, these are the, um, the, the the manufacturing you know uh, sector and not and not service as such. So, but if you have an interest in, in becoming a black industrialist, uh, here is an opportunity um, to be able to be supported. Uh, um, other sectors: chemical, uh, pharmaceutical, plastic, nuclear, um, manufacturing related logistics aerospace, rail, um, ICT, etc., etc. So maybe you want to produce the MP500 and the, and the, the likes that the guys were talking about, then you'll be able to, to qualify, uh, but only if you're going to do uh, value addition, so not buying and, and selling. You can import and finish product, and then you do the final um, uh, value addition here in South Africa, you'll still be able to, um, you know, uh, the, to qualify. But if you are just a middleman or a middle woman, unfortunately, you wouldn't be qualified in this program. We want uh, people that are there to to add value, to to increase our uh, manufacturing base as a, as a country, so that in the process we are able to create uh, to create the necessary jobs. So as I said, the, there's three legs or three support to the, to the program. Um, the first one being um, a, a grant uh, with the co uh, cost sharing arrangement. Uh, and the cost sharing could be non-financial. So you might say I've got a factory, uh, 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 I have a factory or I have land already that I have acquired. I want to use that as my 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 sub, my my, my cost-sharing um, contribution that also is 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 acceptable. But the cost-sharing is between 30 to 50 percent, depending on the nature of the the, the, the of the uh, of, of the program. 
So as a DTI, we do give grants. So ours is a grant. It's, uh, it's not a loan. Um, um, uh, but we won't give you cash, because then you'll go and buy a Range Rover. Um, you'll, you'll tell us that, no, I need a, this machinery. Maybe you want to, to buy a machinery from Germany or wherever that you're going to use in your factory. Then we are able to, 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 uh, to, to assist you in, 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 in buying that machinery and not giving you cash. Uh, and, then we, and then we are in the headline that a DTI give money, um, throw money into the sea. So we don't give cash um, directly to you, but we're able to assist you um, with regard to what you would like to, to purchase. And then if you still need more funding, then our DFIs, the Development Financial Institutions, such as IDC, NEF, National Empowerment Fund, the uh, Land Bank, depending on the sector, they are then able to supplement whatever financial support that you might still you might, you might still need. But theirs, of obviously, is not a, it's not a, a grant, uh, it's a loan. But the grant really do, do assist you in, in leveraging uh, more loans from, from them, also from the, from the bank. Then the second support measure, access to markets. We have an, an, um, we, we collaboration with the state-owned entities uh, to ensure that we, we give market access to, to to some of the enterprises uh, that we, we support, whether it's ESCOM, whether it's a Transnet, we do have that arrangement with them um, uh, in ensuring that they do give market access. Also with the private sector, for example, in the auto, auto industry, we, we work uh, very well with VW uh, in, in giving up um, market access to some of the components, black components manufacturers uh, that they have been able to uh, that we have been able to support over time, including Ford as well. So we work with both the, the private sector as well as our state-owned entities to ensure that there is, um, there is access to, uh, to market. And then the last leg of support is with regard to capacity building. So, so if you say I'm a black industrialist, but I need training in a particular area, um, we are able also to support you in that area. We do have also, we work closely also with Productivity SA, and they are able to, to, to give you the necessary support that you, that you need um, as a, as a black, black industrialist. So, as I said, this is the, uh, um, you know, the program. Uh, I just wanted to create awareness around it. Uh, it's strictly for manufacturing, but as I said, um, the plan is, is to, to replicate it in other sectors. Um, and I will also want to challenge you as a sector that you need to talk to um, your, your line ministry, the DSC, to say, uh, can they create a similar, um, a similar program that is more relevant to your sector, um, the events and the technical production uh, services. Already, the Department of Tourism, um, we are assisting them to develop a similar program, but that will be for the tourism and the hospitality uh, industry. Because all, over, all what we want, we want to see world-class uh, black industrialists, black people running their own enterprises. I'm impressed by the gentlemen, the, the guys who were here. They are, you know, they running with their own brands, you know, internationally recognized, etc. Um, and that's what we need also in all other avenues, in all other sectors. We want to see black people running uh, black-owned enterprises. Uh, we don't want to give handouts, um, but we want people that are serious about um, running their own businesses, people that are able to, to contribute back to the, to the, to the, to the coffers of the, of the country.